Welcome to Street Solar Life. Uh, today we are going to see the solar panel selection for one location. It will be it will be too cold. I uh, think uh, yeah, my fingers also it's too much cold. I hope we are into that location already. Uh, yeah, it's the location will be the Kulu Monali. It's located in Simla. I think everyone knows that uh, what exactly the location and how it's supposed to be and uh, how uh, the locations and then natures the weathers the atmosphere everything uh, many people have uh, doubts so uh, you may see a lot of uh, um, cloudy and uh, uh, the climates will be too much of cold uh, even the minus whatsoever uh, may have a uh, doubts so many people have a uh, doubts about the uh, panel solar panels how it's supposed to be how it works and all uh, if it there is a uh, too much of uh, cold climate uh, <laughs> i don't think so <laughs> Uh, the systems uh, uh, that's going to be give, or give the things uh, uh, I think you have seen uh, a lot of videos in the past uh, if that is the dust I said uh, here there are a lot, lot of ice going to be seen on this panels too so based upon the conditions you have to clean accordingly uh, to uh, generate the energy okay uh, so here we have taken the calculations based upon the if the panel is cleared 100% if you talk about the cold climate okay uh, so otherwise uh, uh, so don't uh, think uh, uh, don't assume yourself that the, my calculation is exactly that's the for the entire year of course you have to maintain the uh, panels very clean Baba yeah uh, fine uh, so now we are going to see that that's the exact location say Kulu Manali it's a Manali uh, the exact location I could say here what we have considered uh, it's a hotel Kanishka Manali that's the exact locations so we have considered for these calculations so, so here we could say uh, the latitude and longitude should be uh, just a minute oh, oh, sorry just not had a food so so the latitude will be uh, 32.24 and longitude would be 77.18 I hope uh, I have seen uh, there is no shared temperatures on this location that's uh, uh, if you talk about the particular uh, latitude and longitude uh, yeah so that's the exact locations it's located in uh, Kulu Manali uh, it's uh, Everyone knows in Indian, I think many people, even global also, many people know the Manali and Simla, if you talk about. Uh, so that's exactly located in Himachal Pradesh, that's located in India. So we have a concern that locations like what the reading is going to be sit on that, assume if we have the residential or commercial to that place, to that exact locations. Uh, we have a concern uh, basic uh, calculations as we uh, we are keep on discussing in past videos as well. Uh, so here we what we have uh, considered here uh, it's a 25 watts uh, load uh, four numbers running for five hours per day 10 watts loads uh, total numbers five hours uh, four hours uh, running per day 100 watts loads four number uh, 12 hours uh, running per day 100 watts load one number eight hours running per day 50 watts load two number 12 hours running per day so all this load running for 100 percent of duty cycles uh, so here uh, we want you to be uh, clear before proceeding the system so if you have already installed the solar panels so if you are not sure what goings you are going to get and what readings you are generating probably you can approach us and there are many of people so even the firms are working on the system related to the solar projects as well if you have any concerns if you want to calculate re-evaluate anything so probably you can put a mail to street solar life at gmail.com so a team of experts had worked many uh, global projects related to the solar as well so we are also caring to many uh, people and firms related to the solar and if you have any requirements related to the remote locations so particularly you could be the city or far away from the city as well uh, probably if, if you have uh, any uh, concerns related to the system designs probably you can approach to gmail.com we are here to help you so here how we do that we used to calculate all the units so as you see here based on upon these calculations so it's required at 2855 units so you need to be generated from the solar oh sorry this one's fine you need to generate 2855 units per year so 
to uh, run these loads uh, so you have to switch the solar panel as per this calculation so also we want you to understand that system is supposed to be based upon the calculations it's not based upon only cloud and kv and so 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 and so uh, so here uh, think uh, we have also considered the polycrystalline panels uh, we also uh, uh, what we do is we took the weather data uh, for the historic data even if you talk about we are not considering the year we used to take the historic data we used to calculate all the weather conditions uh, related to this location exactly to these locations and then we do you do we do the calculations uh, related to the solars uh, so we um, uh, calculate with the weather as well as the panel specifications so we also you have to see the panel specifications uh, and then you have to size the panels accordingly so it's not just matter of a plug and play job so once you've done everything is perfect uh, then you are the one good in the world I could say so here uh, according to these calculations for these locations uh, you need to go with uh, 4600 WP polycrystalline panel to achieve these uh, units uh, it means it's to generate this many units for that location so here if you want to be clear uh, this the location is similar right uh, so you have to see the climate conditions so your panel uh, we have taken the uh, we have taken the calculations based upon the historic data we have not considered the complete dust here even though we have considered the dust is by considering the minimum if you are increasing the percentage of dust so that will be increasing the performance of the panels it means that you have to increase the panel size as well so for the particular month probably a two or three so that will be zero on the system so if your panels is completely secure from the cold climates then this is the going to be exact so that's we want to understand systems so that's we are trying here yeah so according to this calculation so that's the unit so we are saying that and that's the panel sizing so if you are planning to store the energies to the batteries so you have to see the battery when selecting the battery as well you have to see the lot of characteristics uh, when you talk about to see uh, that there is two things in those uh, selecting the batteries and what's our electronic skates etc so you have to see the temperature so positive as well as you have to see the negative temperature as well I believe the climate is also too cold here when there is some uh, uh, due to the some particular seasons here so you have to work out accordingly uh, here uh, when you select the batteries as well you have to see the lot of engineering criteria related to the characteristics and DOD etc if you are planning for storage energy I believe you may need to uh, store a lot of energies for this uh, location so probably you may require the three days five days uh, that will be good for certain loads so if you have your applications are very important or if you're running any kind of villa or some other special applications related to the industrial or something else or for certain cases uh, you have to go and you have to increase the autonomy I mean increase the ba ba backup of the systems so for these locations so I could say here uh, if uh, really important probably can go ahead based upon your budgets uh, I hope uh, we have covered all the points here uh, so we, uh, we have an engineering team who have many years experience in the global projects so, so what we do is we used to take uh, all the prehistoric data so as well as we used to calculate all the panel size and characteristics so, so it's not a plug and play job or it's, matter of, it's not a matter of a kilowatt or kva so it's purely depends upon the calculations and then specification of the panels and we are going to install that the locations you have to see that so then weather conditions etc has to be you could say is more than 50 characters you have to see and then you have to look into the sizing of the cables or conversion kit or protection circuit slots so it's up to you whether you want to be designed for a, a two year five year 10 or 20 so it's purely depends upon your budgets as well as if you are putting more effort at the beginning stage you can avoid the running costs so that's what we are trying to explain here and thank you for watching this video. Thank you. Bye.